Hello everyone and welcome back to my playthrough of Persona 3 Reload. Last time we were continuing on the depths of Tartarus, traversing through them after I was embarrassingly humiliated by dying for my first time to a tough enemy. But we persevered. We pressed on and we managed to make it to the next barrier uh, in the Tartarus area. Um, I did actually grind a little bit afterwards uh, to get a decent amount of money. It looks like I grinded for about four hours. Um, and I did manage to gain quite a bit of leveling, uh, surprisingly. Um, I guess the area I was in was a lot tougher than I anticipated. Um, on the plus side, you know, I, I gained some levels, uh, managed to grow my um, personas a little bit, managed to get most of their uh, abilities. You didn't really miss much. Like, in all honesty, most of these personas are going to be switched out sooner or later anyways. Um, I did manage to um, level up uh, my party as well. Uh, I did switch them out um, to uh, basically, um, you know, make sure they kind of grinded like they leveled at the same pace. So uh, I am level 50, and my the rest of my team are like, I don't know, around 45, 46, something like that. Uh, they did gain some different abilities, basically stronger abilities than they had before, like Junpei, like his fire ability, instead of like does light damage, it does medium damage, like that kind of thing, right? Um, and Fuka did get another ability, which, uh, what did it do? I think it basically allowed me to start... No, actually, you know what? I could just, I could literally just check. Just load back into Tartarus here. Load back into the save. Uh, nope, that's not what I wanted. Nope. Stats. Here we go. Fuka. Persona. Shock noise. Inflicts a stress on old foes on the current floor. I don't really know if we're going to be using it all that much, uh, especially since it's since it costs 30 SP, I'd much rather use, like, this one, Sylphidora, or, um, even potentially jamming. But, uh, I don't know. We'll, we'll see how it goes. I, I don't know how well Distress is really gonna do for us, um, on the current floor. I mean, this is the current floor, but still. Um, and I managed to get about, uh, 224,000, um, yen. Which uh, should last us a decent while. Um, yeah. And, uh, yeah, I, I spent a good amount of time. Uh, about four hours. So. Oh, hello. Yes, I want to stop for the night. I don't know how this hour lasted so long, but we will call it. Hope everyone's doing great. Oh yeah, the, the trading. I completely forgot about that. Um, yeah, we're supposed to be moving on to the track finals. Stay focused, everyone. Tomorrow's the big day. Whoa, you're doing great. Thank you. That's the fastest time on the team. Good luck tomorrow. You got this. I see you're back. I am. Here you'll be in that competition tomorrow. You better do your best to win. Also, the, although the, there's this guy, Hayase, who they say is supposed to crush the competition. Watch out for him. Oh yeah, I've heard that name before. He's pretty famous. I've seen him in sports magazines. What's even the point of trying to go up against guys like that? Just wear yourself out. Well, there's a full moon soon, so I guess you can look at it as training or something. Sure. Um, so, just looking at everyone's average level around this time, I am 16 levels above average. Um, and my teammates are, yeah, like 43. And Fuka's 47, yeah, so... 
we're well above where we need to be. But again, I'm 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 okay. It's not I'm not too far up above where I could still die pretty easily, to be honest. I think I think coffee is best taken black. Don't you agree? Or do you drink it uh, another way? I don't drink coffee. I hate coffee, actually. I don't know what Wiener Melanges is. Why? You mean like the sausage? Or are you just teasing me? I mean, there's no way anyone would put sausage in their coffee, right? I drink tea. I drink black tea, actually. I love chai tea. By the way... Do you remember that shadow from the other day? Oh, I'm talking about the one Kurochan defeated. Anyway, for some reason, it reminded me of something Kirijo Senpai said. Uh, about how normal shadows don't usually appear outside Tartarus, but some irregular ones do. Guess they just appeared sometimes back when it was just our Senpais who were fighting them. Yeah, and. Hello, I guess. Rita. My persona can be likened to a shield and halberd. Not only am I skilled at attacking, I can also acquire various support abilities. I'll be a valuable ally in the front lines of battle. Good. Oh yeah, we have our Taiyaki here, don't we? To Yuki, for all your hard work on your club activities, Yukari. So Miyuki, Yukari, I'll gladly accept it. Magi water. Oh, thanks. One bottle of water. Thank you so much. Might as well put my other Taiyaki in here. Why can't I just put the Taiyaki I cleared out from there? Did everything just like shift over when I took it out? Um. Yeah. Match with the heavyweight champion. Not sure if this will help with your tournament tomorrow, but hey, maybe you'll be inspired. So not am I gain a new ability soon. Uh, as much hey, as I right. want to, I think I need to plant. Hey. Want to head to the roof and work on those planters? I check on them once in a while, but I thought I probably shouldn't touch them without you around. Junpei seems motivated. The quality of the produce might improve if we tend to the rooftop planters together. Junpei might gain a new ability soon. Um, yeah, let's do this one. Yeah, we haven't planted anything yet. Um, I think as battle ability rapidly cures it. I think we'll do this one. Um, the one that gives uh, HP back. Yeah, let's do it. <laughs> My thumb's getting a little greener every day, don't you think? For an amateur vegetable patch, it's really coming along. All that back break and work was worth it. Listen, you hear that? That's the sound of our precious little veggies cheering us on. Yeah, I think I do. Right? They're kind of right. growing. Right? This might actually be my calling. Maybe I should just ride this wave and start a farm or something. It's really cool how well they respond if you take care of them right. It's one of those times where you see the fruits of your labor after lots of slow, steady work. I never followed through on anything, and even I pulled it off. That counts for something, right? You really grown up. <laughs> I thought I was the one raising them. Maybe they were raising me all along. Wait, did real, actual wisdom just come out of me? Holy crap, I grew up more than I thought. We owe a lot to our nutritious little veggie babies. Ah, who am I kidding? Our veggie mentors. Well, whatever we do in life, you can't expect to hit a home run on the first swing. We gotta stay on our toes and wait for the perfect chance to strike. And when that time comes, you knock it out of the park. That's how the real sluggers do it. A valuable lesson straight from our vegetable teachers. Don't go forgetting it, you hear? Don't forget it. Junpei learned new things by tending to the vegetable garden. Nice! Critical boost increases critical rate and increases critical hit strength. Fucking A, bro. Maybe I'm finally figuring this whole life thing out, huh? You know, I think I'll write a book. 
I could call it something like Life's a Vegetable Garden, the Junpei Yuri story. Selling books and vegetables? Ooh, we're gonna be rolling in dough. Man, am I a genius or what? Why stop at books? Enough dreaming. Let's get a little bit more work done. Get some podcasts going, some uh, some tapes. I tend to the rooftop planters with Junpei. Woo! We did a heck of a job. See you later, my darling veggies. I'll be back again when I'm free. Well, let's call it a night. Hit me up again when you have some time. All right, let's do the let's do this thing. Oh, it's on a Sunday? That sucks. Today is track and field competition. It's about time to leave. You got this, yo. Attention! The time is upon us to demonstrate outstanding sportsmanship. May the best runner win. Hey, you're almost up. How are you feeling? Think you got this? Fuck yeah. Definitely. Oh, that's what I like to hear. Since this is your first time, let me give you some advice. All you have to do is give it your all. Remember, oh, is that it? mind over matter. And the biggest enemy out there is yourself. All right, dude. Go show them what you're made of. I can't believe it's your first time competing. On top of that, this was your fastest time yet. Man, you killed it. Looks like all your hard work paid off. Still a bummer, though. Even with your incredible performance, that guy still won. Really? You mean Hayase, right? They say he blows everyone out of the water in every competition. I thought people were exaggerating. Jeez, he's insane. I could sure use someone like him on our team. Ah, damn it! We'll get him next time for sure. Hey, wait. Isn't that him? Yo, you're pretty fast. Not fast enough. Plenty enough to make me sweat a bit. Hey, I know this is weird all of a sudden, but would you want to hang out sometime? Sure. Cool. Sounds good. You still need to work on your technique, but I feel like you've got potential. Maybe you could help push me to test my limits. I usually grab a bite to eat at the strip mall in Iwatodai after school. Stop by sometime if you feel like it. The name's Mamoru Hayase. Well, I'll see you around. Wow! Hayase must really see you as a worthy rival. You see him again? Tell him this. Next time I'll kick your ass! You got that? Calm down, cause. By the way, wasn't that Nimura guy from Third High supposed to be pretty good too? He never showed. Yeah, I was talking to some of the guys from his school. Apparently they couldn't get a hold of him. They even went out to check his house, but he wasn't there. Uh-oh. So he's gone missing. Did he run away from home? Maybe he was afraid of going up against Hayase. Or wait. Do you think it's because of that apathy syndrome thing? No idea. Hope he shows up again soon in one piece. Yeah. Anyway, uh, now's not the time to get down in the dumps. Our school did great today, after all. Good job out there. All right. Thank let's you. Let's get out of here. Decided to head back with my teammates. Put in a good amount of effort. Oh, it's you. Welcome back. Thank you. I heard from Akihiko that you did well in the competition. Too bad I didn't win. No. Regardless, I'm impressed with your ability to balance so many aspects of your life successfully. Huh. Yeah, that's amazing. You should give yourself some more credit. If nothing else, you're at least doing something unlike someone else I know. Mm, thanks, I guess. Yeah, yeah, sticks and stones can break my, uh, 
whatever. Anyways, it's almost a full moon, right? That's something I can do. Uh, the mission, I mean. Yeah. Yeah, the next full moon is on August 6th. That's Thursday. It's likely the enemy will be stronger than the last ones. Make sure you're ready. Alright. Winning tournaments is cool and all, yeah, but now it's time for the real battle. And for us, losing ain't an option. Get ready for some action. Good to see you. I heard you you're done with the competition. You must be tired, right? Maybe we shouldn't go to Tartarus then. Get some rest. I wasn't planning on it. Excellent. Mastery of both academic obligations and combat is no mean feat. And yet you continue to deliver. Keep up the good work. Good job. Placing in the top rank of a club that you just started? Well done. Wish we could take on some full moon shadows while you're still in the zone. Jeez. Junpei should really join a school club or something. He looks so bored every day. He would probably have fun on some sports team. He always has so much energy after all. Let's see what's on TV. On the next episode of Phoenix Ranger Featherman R. Episode 24, The Giant Robot March. Icarus, Garuda, combine! On to today's news. More apathy syndrome victims succumb to heat stroke today. Ooh, that's gotta suck. You wanna help with the stuff I planted? Let me just see if there's anyone here. Oh, oh let me buy, let me buy some little drinky drinks. Because, why not? Let's see if there's anything going on. Nope. Alright, you can help Excuse tend. Me. I would like to suggest maintaining the rooftop garden today. Plants are surely waiting our, our continued care. Yeah. I have further analyzed data on home gardens. Let us proceed to the rooftop. Alright. Yes. Got nothing better to do. Understood. I will begin making my way to the rooftop with maximum efficiency. Shrock boost. There appears to be less damage from pests than the data in my prediction suggests. We haven't taken any specific measures against them. What is the cause of this? Oh, this is... Look, I've sighted a ladybug larva. It's very small and adorable. Uh, just leave it alone. Agreed. We wouldn't want to interrupt it while it's eating. Ladybugs are the natural predators of pests that damage plants. That would explain why there weren't any harmful insects around. Thank you very much, little ladybug. Even in just these tiny planters, there is so much life. There's no one to teach them. They're just doing the best they can. Hmm. My apologies. I got distracted. Let's keep working. Attend to the plants with Igis. Excuse me. Please apply the repellent on that end. Pests deserve no mercy. Thanks to the care we put in, it looks like the plants will grow nicely. Status reads all green. No problems to report. That concludes our mission for today. We should head back now. Yeah, sir, I never really thought about it. Like, insects, especially, um, they just kind of go on instinct. Even, uh, like, I don't think, uh... Good morning. This is Elizabeth. I am calling to inform you that more humans have wandered into Tartarus. Two this time, I believe. Please swiftly and safely conduct a search and rescue. Goodbye mm -hmm. now. Goodbye. Um... They don't really have, like, their parents don't teach them or anything as far as I know. Same with fish, you know? Um, once you're born, that's it. Like, you gotta you gotta learn to fend for yourself. And there are a lot of insects that even um, are loners. Reptiles, too, like... I don't know, like, I don't think snakes really live in packs or anything. I think they just do their own thing. It's just interesting how instinct works. Like a worm, like a worm is born. No, no one, no one teaches a worm to be a worm. You know what I mean? It's interesting. So it's on this TV. There's nothing good on. No. 
Okay, let's see what's going on. Um, okay, before we do anything else, let's see if there's any new kind of seeds here. Oh, that cop's out here. Could watch a movie. Welcome. Take your time. So we wanted the tomato, and then she doesn't have the tomato. Um, if anything, I'd probably grow more of uh, the Am the Amrunian. Let's just order get Please, four for now. Again. So what's playing right now? The way of the godson. Courage. We're hiring people who have the guts to talk to anyone. You'll also learn more about movies. Part-time wage starts at 5,000 yen. Seems like I can work part-time here on days I have off from school. Help it improve my academics and courage. Uh, not now. Let's see what we can do. The Bologna Mall here. Mazomi. Um, yeah, sure, why not? Oh, hey, Jupe. Nice. Come on, we like we can't let Koromaru beat us. Let's go to Tartarus, man. I mean, it's the middle of the day. Sometimes that girl over there who's stalking me loses my trail. I don't know why, but I get anxious when that happens. Wait a sec, am I obsessed with her too? Don't know. Um, let me see if there's some right, right. stuff we can buy. Oh no, wait, there's probably cheaper stuff on Saturday. <laughs> You'll like the new stuff we got in stock. Take a look around, yeah? So this stuff, we could probably stock up a little bit on this stuff, but on Saturday, when it's cheaper. Yeah. Done already? Thanks! Um... Did you just see that? Look at that guy over there. He just spit his gum into the fountain. So disgusting. What is he thinking? That he doesn't want his gum anymore? So we have... We only have a couple of days. Are you fucking kidding me? I just spent four hours grinding with barely any SP left when I have to go back into Tartarus like now because I only have two days to find these people <sighs> yeah what'd you bring wanna all right I'll take that 76,000 what well, I got some stuff you might find useful so feel free to browse so what I currently have? Random ailment. Um, well, the accuracy and the damage is better on this one, that so might as want? well. Great, it's all yours. And equip. Alright. Plus 20 HP. But this one does considerable more damage. People have been using bows as weapons since ancient times. Huh? Made up in yeah. Alright then. Mm. No, don't sell it. Agility plus three, eh? Uh, no, Everything we'll look good here? Alright, yep. prices are a bit lower today. Take a look, if you have the chance. I actually can completely forgot. Oh, it is Monday. So, this is the best time. Oh yeah, it even says sale. Do we? 
Resist charm. I mean, that would be good for him. What is he wearing? Oh, right. Jack's gloves. Charm high. Yeah, we'll keep those. Gabu! Medium poison. Yeah, but the one we have now, the freeze boost, uh, that's pretty good. There's an air of panic in the streets lately. Huh? Made up your mind? Good, yeah. It's all yours. And equip. Three finger firing mechanism that uses the latest technologies. Why would a police department have something like this? Technology that's not even available in the real world. Uh -huh. What are you looking for? Um, yeah, all right, that's want? fine. Well, what do I currently thoughts? have? Plus 30 HP. No, I think this one's better. Because it gives basically 20, uh, 21 defense. 30 HP would be nothing compared huh? to that. Made up your it's all yours. Clip. Uh, don't sell it. Yeah. That what you want? All right, then. This one we can sell. What is it currently wearing? Slugger's jacket plus 40 HP. Yeah, why not? Keep that. That what you want? Yep. All right, then. Clip. And you can sell that. that what you All right, then. Clip and sell. Okay, strength plus two, or yeah, we'll go with that. What you want? Hey, it's all yours. Well, and footwear. Evasion. That what yeah. you want? Hey, it's all yours. So she's wearing something better and gives her more strength. Why not? And he's wearing floaty sandals, which gives one more eva uh, evasion, physical evasion as well. That's fine. everything stocked here is through my personal connections. Whatever you get, and however you use it, huh? Made up your mind. All right then. Clip. You know what? So you can sell this one. All right then. Resist shock. Oh, it's resist shock. I thought it was a res resist electricity. Everything no, good here. All right then. Uh, yeah, you can sell that. Okay. Yeah, I just went through like a quarter of my money right there. Uh, but what are you looking for? Definitely worth it. Twenty SP. Eight thousand. Uh, for twenty. It's worth it. Hmm? You finished? Come back yeah. soon. Man, I'm really pissed off that we have to go back to Tartarus. Don't those kids look strange? That one near the clubhouse. Is he from Gekko Khan? They look sort of slacking and I'm moving. Is he being lazy since the summer vacation? One of the women in my neighborhood is a kid who goes to Gekko Khan. She's energetic and sweet. Very different from those kids. Listen. Think about my clothes. Well, you see, the reason I wear a school uniform is oh, it's hard to find something that'll fit. Anyway, want to go for a bite somewhere? My poor stomach has been crying for a while. Uh, I don't think our bond will grow. Yeah. Oh, actually. Really? Let's. Take out Elizabeth first. I forgot where she wanted to go. Good day. Here are my requests. What's the new one? Oh, she wanted to go. All oh, right, that, that's why. I've been waiting for you. I've been waiting for you to ask. Shall we be on our way? I hate people that do that. You're so cool. 
flowing stairs that pose an obstacle to those who dare to reach another floor. So, this is an escalator. A simple contraption at first glance. But one false step will leave one mired in an exhausting ordeal. To Indeed. all customers, for your own safety and the safety of others, please do not move in the opposite direction of the escalators. Thank you. Oh my. It seems that these customers may come to harm. We'd best exercise caution ourselves. And what is this? Please watch your step. There is a pitfall just ahead. Where is it? Oh, that big hole in the middle? Yeah. Why, it's right over here. There, oh. in the center of this fenced off area. Oh, that, it's that's marked with eye catching signs proclaiming yeah. in bold print do not enter. That's only been there for what's it been four months now? Yeah, it, just part of the scenery. Just, just ignore it. Humans are frequently drawn to what has been forbidden. This is a crafty snare, one that defies the common notion that pitfalls must be hidden. Flowing stairways, pitfalls employing high-level psychological tactics. Human authorities truly go to great lengths in their quest to preserve the town's law and order. I'm very moved by their dedication to the cause. Let us carry on. Our thoughts with the unsung heroes who give their love and lives to this town. Oh! This tantalizing fragrance. Can it be? Takoyaki. Was I right? I was right. Whoa! You can figure out our secret ingredient with just a whiff? I guess you got a funky sense of smell to go with your funky sense of style, lady. Well, there ain't a law saying takoyaki shops can't cook other stuff besides octopus. So, how about it? Wanna buy some? I swear my takoyaki's so good it'll make your jaw drop. Cuisine so scrumptious that one's jaw can drop off? I imagine that would warrant urgent medical care, realistically speaking. But I would very much like a taste. Unfortunately, this is all I have on me at the moment. I do hope this is sufficient. Uh, it's not that expensive. No need to console me. My curiosity far exceeds any monetary. Oh, I see. Upon closer inspection, a single serving is only 400 yen. <sighs> Well, well then, Ooh, two orders of your finest takoyaki, please. Thanks. Here you go, and come again. This distinct texture, the firm, chewy skin, there's no doubt about it. I must say, I'm surprised to see this used as a cooking ingredient. See what? The human mind. It is cursed to forever retain whatever knowledge it gains, whether good or ill. Forgive my reticence, but some questions are better left unanswered. <sighs> there appear to be several dining establishments around here. We must simply visit all of them. My first priority is to go to something called a net cafe, where one may use something called a soda fountain. This apparatus allows for an infinite combination of flavors by mixing various solutions. Just thinking about it gives me a sort of electric tingle across my tongue. <sighs> I see. My. Oh, my. Oh, how intriguing. We appear to have exhausted every dining option in this area. Oh dear, is something the matter? Now I'm that I think up. about it, you haven't eaten much since our seventh meal. Oh jeez. I must thank you for your delightful company. I shall certainly savor this experience. 
If you don't mind, I'd very much appreciate it if you were to escort me again sometime. How about the hospital? I returned to the velvet room with Elizabeth. I hate how you have to talk to her again. It's like, when we return, just give me my fucking reward. Thank you for earlier. Now then, how may I be of assistance? Are you accepting about a request? The request? Let's hear the results. Thank you for showing me around Iwata Dai Station. The fascinating rise, the dangerous traps, and of course, the cornucopia of curious cuisine. Marvelous. The way people went about their lives there was quite different from those at Polonia Mall the other day. So that I might not forget what we saw, I'd like to recreate some of the dishes we sampled. <laughs> First, I must hunt for ingredients. <laughs> this will be so much fun. Please take this as your reward. Book of the Ancients. Uh, I can now fuse Thoth, uh, one who measures time. Julio. Uh, no. Very well. All right. After our seventh meal, we're gonna go with Listen. Gourmet King for another seven meals. Yeah. You're not gonna eat that? Mind if I have it? Feel my bond growing. Yep. It's almost dark. I decided to fuck off back to the dorm. Welcome back. Yep. Yep, it's coming up quickly. Make sure you're prepared. I'm I'm prepared, don't worry. Okay, well, at least it's Mitsuru's thing tonight. Leader. There's something you should know about. Uh, you should know regarding my persona. It seems my persona excels in endurance. Basic attacks will do nothing against me. In other words, I'm a tough guy. Um, I see. Um, hey. Last month's operation didn't go so smoothly because the enemies were behaving erratically. So I'm doing some visualization training and exercises to ensure that doesn't happen again. I'll do my best to support everyone. Bad. Junpei is in quite high spirits, huh? Maybe he just doesn't want to lose to Koromaru. Well, I certainly understand that feeling. I don't like the idea of some dog swooping in and hogging all, right. all our glory. If you're heading to Tartarus, I'll join you. I want to go wild tonight. Well, we have no choice. we got to rescue those two fucking people. Man, I know it... I'm really... I'm really upset. Um. Like, I'm going just to rescue those people. What a waste of a night. Oh, yes! Tartarus appears to have a special little guest today, and between his jaws, it clenched a fragment that emitted a curious blue light. Should your curiosity get the best of you, perhaps it'd be best to pay this guest a visit. Believe it will likely be on floor 72. Floor 72. Okay, but what about the rest of the fucking people? Good day. I can sense it. Okay, 78 and 81. Oh, yes. So 72. No. What was it? 78 Very and 81? Well. Let's do this one first. Yeah, let's do this one first. Uh -huh. There's a person nearby. Must be one of those people, missing people who wandered in here. Getting a signal from floor 79. Time to start exploring. Okay, let's head out. Well, if anything, this will be a quick trip. Now that those giant faces on the wall are gone, it's not as scary, is it? Yeah. 
best bet with me. Persona! Yeah, I forgot how much damage that does, man. Might as well equip the persona. Yeah, I've I've maxed out a lot of people. Uh I guess I'll do him. Oh! I just realized. He's got the heart. Which means uh after a certain level. He'll, uh, he'll give me something. Soul Seed Driblet. I don't know what that is. And so does Narcissus. But Narcissus didn't give me anything. Well, Narcissus will has growth, so... Can, uh... Oh, fuck. So we can earn XP even though he's not participating. Alright, anyways. And who's it? It's one of those chests. Alright, has to go this. first. Two enemies. You can take them. Yes. Remember, right you can stop at things like that. <laughs> Read you like a book. Impressive footwork, Sonata Senpai. Yes. That's a win for the team. Good job, everyone. Went off without a hitch. Let's get going. Alright, there's the person. <laughs> Getting the reading of a person. Please go secure them right away. Um. I'm sure there was someone here. Please check everywhere, please. Let's get yeah. him on, party people. Gil, there's a shadow. Slashed him good, yeah, I did. Only no, like a chance. scimitar, eh? Long and inevitable, dude. One more. Enemy eliminated. Yes. Nice one, Sonata Senpai. This. All enemies defeated. All right. Good work out there. Well, yeah, I wanted to get the XP so I can get the heart. The heart item. And that's a wrap, folks. Uh, didn't we just pass this area earlier? It's so confusing. It's getting on my nerves. Hey, there's a treasure chest. Okay. All kites. Better nice, better nice. Good job, everyone! 
And that's a wrap, folks. Yo, someone's there. Come on, we got it. Um. Okay. Uh, we need to provide treatments. Please return to the entrance. Yes. Let's take him back. Okay. And then let's go to floor um. 72. Uh, I guess we'll go 68. Um. So next floor. I was saying, I'm like, the All aesthetic right, looks different. Move it. Shadow up ahead. We're taking it out. Yeah. The atmosphere here has changed drastically. Please be careful. Alright, let's do this! Did I miss? Oh, yeah. You hurry, you are not one down! And that's how it's done. Good teamwork, everyone. Now on to the next. See that? Oh, there's a treasure chest. Huh. This place is incredible. Now, Remember, so you can stop at things like that. Nice one, All right. Day or next day activity, social stats will increase more than usual. Eh. Uh, yeah, I'll take this one. Yes, we did it! Let's do the same thing for our next fight. How many do I have? I only have two. No, I'm not gonna open. I'm gonna save him. We could be in for one match. You've got the initiative. They don't seem very strong. Let's go! So actually, one thing I forgot to mention is um, if you're way higher than, uh, if you're, um, if your level is like way higher than, than the shadow, then they'll actually be scared of you and it'll cause distress automatically. I'm still setting up. It'll take a little more time. What to do? Uh, of course. Sonata Senpai, send us down! Are you okay? I'm freezing. You'll regret that! Yukari Chan's frozen! Care of this. She can't no, move! Totally you can't- We can- And this, this is where up. you die. Better grip those teeth! Time to put you down! No, I said I don't want that. Does it look like we'll be needing a ten count? Very nice. Nailed it. Nice going, Junpei.
Oh, little kitty cat. Okay. Okay. It's a faint signal. It's a faint signal, but it's there. You just have to fight. Now, what do we run into next? Uh, this guy. We've got the upper hand. Enemies weak to ice. It's freezing solid. No, 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 yeah, and I guess so putting him in distress makes him more likely to be a critical attack. Uh, I will take the money. Yes, we did it. Let's do the same thing for our next fight. Shadow up ahead. We taking it out? Yeah. Another day on the job. Keep it up, everyone. One left. Enemy defeated. You're doing great. All right, attention. Here we go. The level of your currently equipped persona will increase by one. Oh, okay, sure. Yes, we did it. <laughs> Perfecto. Perfecto. There's a little kitty. There's a cat that looks pretty nonchalant. There's a kitty in a place like this? Anyway, we need to protect it. Please come back to the entrance immediately. Take back to the entrance. Yes. The cat offered me something that was holding in its mouth. Maybe it's a thank you gift. It's a bit damp, but I think I can still use it. Three Twilight Fragments. Alright, I'll take it. Welcome back. It's there for now. We'll send it off safely when the time comes. All Good right. day. Uh, Here plus. are my requests. Nice. Wonderful. Be chain. I will await a now need 800 of shadows. Uh, by missing persons. Seems to be human between 83 and 89. No. Very well. So there was three things in here. Um. A teleporter. Uh, 84. Okay, cool. Don't need to go far. Oh, there's a treasure chest. Yeah, it's fine. Yeah, we're going to go first. Now it's all awesome. you want to them, huh? You can take them. Focus. Last one. Yeah. Let's finish this. That didn't hit. Just about what I expected. Good work out there. Oh <laughs> yeah! Who's up next? I've been in good form at archery practice lately. Maybe because I have experience fighting now? Yeah, that's it. That's why. Come up. person. Oh! 
Treatments. Yes. Stick back to the entrance. Okay, and I believe that should be it. <sighs> Tried another search, but I'm still not picking up anyone else's presence. Seems you've rescued everybody who accidentally ended up in Tartarus. Good day. Very well. Okay. Let's get the fuck out of here. Wondering if I should grind again, like make use of this night. No, we'll be okay. We'll be okay. Got a text message. Guess who's bored? No school and no track practice. Guess that means we gotta have uh, somewhere. We gotta go somewhere fun. Let's hang out. Looks like Yuko wants to hang out. Uh, yeah, sure. Why not? Ah, <laughs> uh, finally. Glad we made time to hang out instead of settling for rushed hellos between classes. Nice threads. You got some pretty good taste. I mean, it's a t-shirt and some slacks. Like, well, khakis, probably. Unlike Kaz, who just wears his track jacket everywhere. Embarrassing, honestly. You gotta have clothes that aren't school swag. Hey! Take me, for example. How's my outfit? It's cute on you. Hmm. You think it's cute, huh? Maybe it's just me, but getting called cute feels a little patronizing. But I know you don't mean it like that, so I'll take it as a compliment. Yuko looks kind of embarrassed. I learned a little more about her today. Nice. Let's wander around a little more and find a bite to eat. But let's not get takoyaki. Nothing ruins an outfit like a big flake of seaweed stuck in your teeth. But it's so good. We hung out for a while longer before going our separate ways. Welcome back! Sup, dude? Day after tomorrow's full moon, huh? I'm already getting fired up. Let's kick some ass! <laughs> it's honestly hot as hell, but at least I'm one cool dude. Anyways, you know you can always count on me, right? Our enemies got nothing on me. By the way... I thought you'd like to know. Koromaru's condition seems to be improving. Glad to hear Precisely. it. Yes, he may have a diminutive figure, but he's a fighter. We would do well to learn from his example and stay vigilant in our own endeavors. That was pretty good. Training during the season is really exhausting. I'd like to wring a little more range out of movement out of my body. I'd like to wring a bit more range out of range of movement out of my body. Wow, I can't read. But maybe I should stop and rethink my pacing. Um, why go that far? About that. To become even stronger. After all, shadows are getting tougher. Shit, could I have put something in here? I completely forgot. Oh, 827, that's what it was. Okay. I think we've gotten all we can out of Yukari. Um. Bought a DVD of another show. I hear this one's supposed to be kind of scary, too. Uh, it doesn't seem like your car will gain any more new skills even if I watch DVD with her. But, might improve my charm. Uh, maybe another time. Gotcha. Talk to me if you change your mind. Okay. Ooh, Tanaka. Tanaka-san. Oh, well, if it isn't, Yuki. Are you busy at the moment? If not, I can teach you a valuable life lesson. 
free of charge, of course. Seems like President Tanaka wants to talk to me. I feel like I might grow closer to President Tanaka soon. Yes, let's <laughs> do it. Bye, aren't you enthusiastic? And let's not waste any more time. My schedule is so terribly packed. I don't usually have time for your average Joe, you know. You should be glad you're such a handsome boy. All right, let's add a new word to our vocabulary today. Repeat after me. Placebo. Hmm, the stress is on the middle syllable. Placebo. Very good. You're feigning interest well. Gazebo. A placebo is a pretend pill. Basically, it's a medicine to give you peace of mind. Imagine this. A supplement to eliminate those unsightly love handles without lifting a finger. Or a car navigation system that uses real-time image data to make your commute all the smoother. Or at least make it feel that way. These are just a fraction of our unique line of products. Wow. Huh? You're really wowed by those bogus products? I suppose one could see them as rather spectacular. Our business doesn't provide tangible benefits. It provides peace of mind. And how does that go Take without that? Take emergency supplies, for example. People feel safe just because they have them, don't they? No. As it turns out, <laughs> the more money people spend, the better they feel. Now then, that's it for today's lesson. You can pay me back when you make your first million. <laughs> I received somewhat questionable advice from President Tanaka. I understand him a little better now. He's just a pathetic, pathetic man. Right, Batman? Have you been keeping your promise? You didn't tell anyone, did you? If you go back on your word, you might be surprised to find your profile suddenly on an internet dating site. You wouldn't. Not an online dating- oh, fuck me. Shit. It, there's- there's some things you can't take back. You know what I mean? Like, it's just saying something you can't- That- that's harsh, man. That's harsh. It's getting late, so I'll head back to the door. Fuck, I hope he doesn't put it on Tinder. Tinder sister site. Fake site. I got a text message. A little refresher. What are you up to today? You're free? Let's go somewhere. Let me know if you can make it before afternoon. Looks like Miyamoto wants to hang out. Um, not now. Now, let's see what else we can do th this morning. Because remember, this is just deepening our bond. Doesn't mean we'll actually level the guy. Uh, that's Bunkichi, right? And Hayase. I forgot about Hayase. Uh... So me, so me too. So I think he's gonna be there every day. I don't know how often Hayase is gonna be there. But we can at least start his social link. What's up, Junpei? Seriously? Damn, dude, the lost are everywhere these days. Maybe we should have our own theme song, you know? Who you gotta call? Shadow Busters. Yeah. Everyone thinks these ghost stories and apathy syndrome are so bad, but personally, they make me jealous. The rich get richer and the poor get poorer. We working class who just work to the bone until we wither away. We're gonna wither and die anyway. Getting apathy syndrome sounds like the better option. I mean, that's kind of a morbid way of looking at it. Someday you'll have jobs like mine and reach the same conclusion. Okay, buddy. As per is customary. Mm. 
must check out the net cafe for new items. Come on in. Come again. Failure encompasses everything I do. Mumble, mumble. All right, hi, Asse. Yo. Hey, Yuki, you remembered me, huh? Gonna grab a bite to eat. Wanna join me? Sure. Yeah. Let's see who can eat faster. Who's the best to run 100 laps around the city? Rip. 100 laps around the city. I'm blending my food and just drinking it. I have his full confidence, but I can feel the courage welling up within me to face him. I can take him on. So I guess you need courage to hang out with him. Hmm? Hey, eat up. Slowing down. Is that all you've got? It's not over yet. Oh, saving your strength for the last stretch, huh? <laughs> then let's do this. Go, 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 go! Hayase and I finish eating at the same time. Whew. Oh, looks like it's a tie. <laughs> Not many people can keep up with me. I'm impressed. Uh, I expected to lose, actually. <laughs> same here. I didn't think I'd win that one. Ooh. Had a lot of guts challenging me at Takoyaki, though. I respect that. I knew you had potential when I met you. I say is a fearless smile on his face. Star Runner from another school is taking a shot to me. Yeah, I forgot this guy was a social link, to be honest. I thou shall The Star The Star Kana. Rival athlete. The way I see it, ties no better than a loss. I'll do like I promise and run a hundred laps around the city. You do whatever you think is best. I'm gonna go home. Heck of a fight today. See you around. Can you even do 100 laps around the city in one day? Like, realistically speaking. Oh, welcome back. Well, tomorrow's a full moon. Are you ready? Yep. Yeah. Good, me too. Well, aside from being ready mentally, we have to get physically prepared, too. We'll be on standby in the dorms tomorrow, so let's get everything that we need tonight. Alright then, let's do our best. Like always. What's up, you Do you need some summer time to get used to the operations? I'm good, thanks. Yes. Good luck on your next one as well. I'll be rooting for you from the shadows. <laughs> Excuse me. Population of the loss increases noticeably for a full moon. I have reconfirmed my objective to assure we win at any cost, no matter what. Um. Hi. We have to win this time too. I'll give it everything I've got so that I can see Korochan again now that he's gotten better. You do that. That that's your motivation. Win the, win the fight against the shadows so you can see the dog again. Not to save the world or humanity or anything like that. No, it's to see the dog again. Good to know that's where your priorities lie. I'm starting to get nervous about tomorrow. I think I'm going to check one more time to make sure I'm fully prepared. You do that. Uh, I don't think I can get anything else from here. I got some good news. I was thinking of splurging and cooking up something nice. Sonata seems enthusiastic. He might gain a new ability soon. Um, I see. Just want to make sure there's nothing else going on. Is there anyone upstairs? No. Alright, Sonata son. You and I, mm -hmm. we got this. It's been much to do on my own, you see. Sure, I'll help. I owe you one. Thanks. Let's get to it. I'll handle the cooking. You just eat, and then take care of cleanup afterwards. This Done. time, I want to try hot pot. I can probably handle that, right? 
I've always wanted to try hot pot. I've always wanted to do that. Hey, don't worry. We've got chicken, onions, carrots, mushrooms, tofu. Hmm, nothing strange here. Just regular ingredients. All right. Why don't you go get a plate and sit tight? I've been so busy lately. I've had to leave most of the boxing team activities to the junior members, but they actually won a team event at a rookie tournament. So I thought I'd put together this little celebration for them. Congrats. <laughs> it was just a small tournament that a third year like me couldn't even enter. But still, they really came together as a team to win it. So even though I wasn't much of a captain for them, I'm still proud of their achievement. I gotta say though, Hot Pot is an interesting concept. Every ingredient adds its own flavor. And the end result is so great. It'd be nice if C's could mesh just as well with a ragtag group of members. I think they could. <laughs> I know everyone's wildly different from each other, but if there's anyone who can make it work, it's you. Anyway, when I'm out there on the front lines, I'll make sure I'm in a position to showcase my strengths. Boxing's taught me that once I get into the rhythm of battle, nothing can stop me. That's my fighting style. Don't forget it. Yes, sir. So now that's passionate about the uh, success of his boxing teammates. Increases the effects of buffs on self. Okay, cool. It's nice to be able to share a hot pot with someone else like this. Maybe I'll do this with the boxing team too, if I ever get a chance. Super athlete meal. All right. Now, how do we finish the broth? Maybe udon? Or rice porridge? <gasps> or how about some protein dumplings? Udon. With protein dumplings. Oh, baby. As you can tell, I, I love Asian food. There will be a full moon tonight. A powerful shadow will appear. I should stay home today and conserve my strength. No, come on. What a waste of a day. Well, here we are. A full moon once again. Any luck, Yamagishi? Yes, I can sense it. There's a shadow reading tonight, as expected. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. It's located by the deserted houses in the northern part of Iwatodai, but there's something strange. The reading is coming from underground. Almost 10 meters. Maybe it's in some kind of basement? According to the records for the northern harbor, there are no structures that match that criteria. However, there once was an underground facility used by the military. The military? Is that true? Well, the architectural and geographical data for the area was uploaded into her memory. Then again, the information hasn't been updated in 10 years. Correct. The data is 10 years old. I doubt they change the infrastructure Shouldn't like that. someone fix that? So how exactly do we proceed? Is the facility still there? We won't know more until we actually get there. Old relics of war. It seems the situation is still unclear at this time. With that in mind, we'll wait until we arrive before we decide who should be deployed. Agreed. Understood. All right, let's go. Iwatsudai Northern Harbor, underground facility entrance. And I just gotta beat my headset is about to die. One minute.
Yeah, sorry about that, guys. I didn't know there was a place like this so close by. Target should be around here somewhere. Oh, <laughs> well done. You couldn't sense them at all until now! It's so nice to finally meet you in person. My name is Takaya. This is Jin. We are known to some as Strega. Now then, we've been keeping an eye on your activities for some time. From what we hear, you've undertaken a righteous battle to save the world. Unfortunately, we've come here tonight to put an end to that. What did you say? You've gained many new allies in such a short time. No doubt because this land crawls with sin. Ah, Tartarus is towering as beautifully as always. You know about Tartarus? You know... Wait. Why the hell would you want to stop us? <laughs> it ain't rocket science. If shadows in the dark hour disappear, we could lose our power. And that's not something we can abide by. Get it? Power? Are you saying your Persona users too? I implore you to think more carefully. Do you really want to lose your abilities? Not just anyone can wield the power of a Persona. The Dark Hour is a frontier that is ours alone to explore. And the same goes for the Tower of Demise. That's your reason for stopping us? Then you're the ones who need to think. Who knows what might happen if we don't do something? A catastrophe brought on by the shadows. What difference does it make, really? Disasters will always exist. And humans will always destroy each other, regardless of what the shadows do. Either way, no one can predict what misfortunes will befall who. But more importantly, it's time you accepted the truth. Surely you will acknowledge the sense of fulfillment the Dark Hour has given you. You're wrong. Yeah, do you think I like this? Is it not so? How about the rest of you? Do you also wish to return to your path? Pathetic ordinary lives. Huh? I don't enjoy this at all. Whatever. You all got your own selfish reasons for fighting. That so called justice of yours <laughs> ain't nothing but an excuse. There's nothing righteous about any of you. Ya. You're all just hypocrites. Like hell, you chumps are gonna stop us. What did you say? <laughs> Have fun in there. It's like, well, I hate to mock and run, but... Damn it! They locked us in. There is no need to panic. Instead of wasting resources, I recommend we prioritize the shadow first. Agreed. Great! If we freak out, then we're just giving them what they want. Shadow's moving. I think it's noticed us. All right, let's focus on our original goal. We can look for a way out after we've won. Go ahead and select your team. Everyone, prepare for battle. Oh, man. Uh, wish I knew what we were facing. Leader. There was a slight accident, but let's focus on the mission for now. I feel the target's presence from beyond that door. Once you're ready, we can go. Uh, let's focus on the shadow right now. Please choose who you'll join the, on the front lines. What is the status of the target? I'm picking up target signal from a spot somewhere below. But it's kind of like multiple readings overlapping. I can't really tell for sure. What on earth could it be? We don't know what we're up against this time either, so be ready for anything. Um... Okay, so I'm thinking I'm good with what I have. 
Maybe swap out Junpei for Mitsuru. And here's my thought process on this. Uh, I want to take Aegis, but if what if the boss is like uh, resistant to any kind of uh, physical attacks, she's useless. She's completely useless. Unless she uses her Theurgy. Um, Junpei and... Both Junpei and Akiko are kind of strength-based. Um, and I much prefer having uh, Akihiko over Junpei. Even though Junpei is stronger. Because Akihiko can also heal. Although we did just get Junpei's crit rate. Nah. Um, yeah, I'm gonna take Mitsuru. Do you want me to go? Let's go together. Uh, switch with Junpei. I think generally for now this is gonna be my go-to party. Again, I could be completely misreading the whole thing, but... That, that's just my thought process. Can I save? I can save. I'm saving a while. Okay. Uh, let's do it. I sense the target two blocks ahead of you. It seems to be moving slowly downward. Don't let it get away. We won't. No time to waste. Let's end this before the dark hour is over. This place... It seems it was some kind of armory during the war. Oh yeah, look at that. There's a cannon. There's cannons. These tracks on the ground seem to be made recently. I wonder... These might belong to our target. Let's keep an eye out. Oh, there's an item. That'll be two of them. Where are all these documents? In the hopes that this message will reach my loved ones, I have sealed this journal for its protection. We few survivors have ensured the completion of our goal. So many of our cohorts will never know our success. I pray that our spirits find rest in the wake of this turmoil. To my mother, my wife, and my children. Please do not think that I've abandoned you. If securing your futures means giving my life, then I will ha have done so happily. Honor my memory by living. Did I miss something up there? I don't think I did. Guys, you're totally in my way. Oh. Well, no. I did miss those, but they didn't give anything, so I didn't miss anything. So they move that way. We'll go we'll get these first. Nice. Oh, just one. Those Persona users just now. Better exercise caution around them. Lucia couldn't sense them at all. Sorry, I'll concentrate on the shadow. Well, at least there's no shadows around, like, draining my SP and all that. The target's gaining speed! It's continuing down the tunnel! Hurry and chase it down! What is it going towards? The target stopped! It turned around! It's waiting for us one block down! Cool. Is that a tank? The target's up ahead. Are you ready? As ready as I'm gonna be. This is the source of the tread marks. I mean, hindsight it had tread marks, so it kind of made sense. It was a tank. It looks like the shadow is using the tank as armor. Get ready, everyone! Here it comes! Justice. Uh, 
No, wait. It's Chariot? What? I only see one enemy, but I'm sensing two of them. I've never seen a shadow like this before. Maybe one's the body, one's the head? Um. I'm still setting up. It'll take a little more time. I'll go with. Never mind. Let's do physical. Yeah, see, it resists physical. Best bet would be. Let's go! Resist lightning. I have to do this. There's no Oh, Shall I move to this strike? is not good. Go for it! This is really not good. Nobody this doesn't look good. Did I scan on this enemy? Analysis complete. Uh, we're fucked. Trying to see which one costs more. I have to do this. Or not costs more, does more damage. Um. There's try it. Yeah, I didn't think so. Uh, since it's targeting Yukari, let's block. Can't afford to lose. Oh! Yukari, I messed that up. Yukari, I even said Yukari and I fucked up. I'll take care of this. I'll do this. Pull the trigger. I move to strike. Might as well. It hasn't even started to use a thing. It's SP at all. What to do? Never mind. How do I? Oops. How do I raise this thing after sending Persona on power? Within gradually enhances. Yeah. It doesn't look like you have the right skills. With. Um You know what? I'll use him because he's got resistance to both slashing and uh bullets, I guess. Or so why not? My dear G. I think I can use it now. Let's 
gonna win this. Let's go! I was right, head and body. Now, the turret is justice, and the larger one is chariot. Yeah, that makes sense. The smaller one seems to have less stamina. Now we can defeat them individually. Okay. Um... I'm ready to strike. Should I scan on this enemy? Should I scan on this enemy? Analysis complete! Should I scan on this enemy? I see. So this is what we're up against. Okay, makes sense. Um, let's do... So this one... Persona! No mercy! That's me! Child's play. Oh... Oh, that was nasty. What? It, revived it? it looks like both enemies can revive one another. You're going to have to defeat them at the same time. That's gonna hit me. Huh? Later. Say something, please. As long as I can retry the battle. I, I think I made the right choices on party members. It's our co I only see What's next? What to do? Make sure that Yukari's guarding this stuff. Uh -huh. Go with. 
Um, yeah, I might as well go back to what's his face. Yeah. Rock I'll take care of this. Appreciate it. I'm ready. I'll show you. I'm trying to work up everyone's theurgy. Word of defense for the fuck. Try harder. Uh, come. And then hit. One step at a time. Let's go. I can use it now. In this situation. This will do the trick. Go with Rock Shotgun. The best bet with me. I've got this. Uh, I'm ready anytime. You know what? I'll do this. You guys are fucked. Goodbye, bitch. I guess maybe I am overpowered quite a bit. But again, you saw I died in one hit. Granted, it was a one hit kill, but still. Yes, I'm here. This is Mitsuru. We've neutralized the target. Ah, good work. Come on back. Actually, there's been a complication. We ran into some interference during the mission. It seems they were Persona users. Persona users? Yes, more than one. They appeared during the dark hour and seemed to know who we were. Hmm. Did they say anything that might give us a hint to who they are? Strega? Now that you mention it... I believe they called themselves Strega. Strega? Hmm. All right. I'll see what I can find out. Thank you. There's one other thing I have to report. We unfortunately fell into Strega's trap, so we're locked inside the facility. Ah, I see. Since the threat has been eliminated, I'll send someone over as soon as I can. 
who? I'm sorry for the trouble. We'll be waiting. Other Persona users. <sighs> An unexpected enemy has emerged. They seem to be Persona users as well. But we still succeeded in defeating the Shadows this month. There should be a fewer victims for a while. I'm exhausted. Can't wait to get some rest. Alright. Successfully defeated one more of them. And we're Friday. So we can talk to Aise or Zomi. What level is Zomi again? Uh, we're making, we're rank seven. Let's uh let's finish this off. Let's finish off Nizomi. Summer vacation, isn't it? You young folk are supposed to be having the time of your lives. You're young, you have plenty of times to make mistakes. In the end, we'll all be fond memories. You know what? He is not wrong. Yeah, I saw that guy tossing the ball in the arcade again. I walked up to him so I could ask what the ball was, but he just glared at me over his sunglasses. Then he walked out of the arcade without another word. Man, he's scarier than I thought. I don't know what ball he's talking about. Our kids are off on their own this summer vacation. I'm exhausted from making their meals every day. One of the women in my neighborhood says she pre-cooks massive amounts of udon. Then she rotates between sesame dressing, ponzu, and shredded daikon, so it always tastes differently. I figured we housewives need summer vacation too, so I decided to copy her method. Hey. Could you hear me out? My stomach is crying in sorrow, but it's not that important right now. Yeah, he's gonna apologize. Yes. Wonderful, my gourmet fur. Uh, no, I'm not here to eat today. I'm here because I wanted to talk to you. Hey, I haven't been doing so well lately, you know. And it's all because of your blasphemy. Or not. I begged so hard for your soul that I think I actually lost weight. Look at me! I'm paper thin now! No, you're not. Damn straight! I could down a ham katsu in my sleep if I really wanted to! I get what you're trying to say. You're embarrassed to be seen with me, right? I'm not like my little brother. I'm not smart or athletic, and I have weird stubby legs. And my pants are covered with food stains. I'm just wash a thorn in everyone's side. They all wish I could be more like my little brother. All they do is make fun of me. I just want this whole world to disappear. But the world can't end yet. Not until I save you first. Look, I can try harder. I just need to make it to paradise. That should solve all my problems. I'll be taller and more slender. And my body will glow, so I'll be safer at night. See? Then I won't be inferior to my brother. Then you won't hate being seen with me. So please, don't abandon me. That's pretty sad, man. Feel a strong connection with Su and Mitsu. I have to go, so I don't have time to eat today. I haven't earned forgiveness just yet. And I have to find a new member to recruit soon. Uh-oh. That was him just now. So can you handle it? Yeah, all I gotta do is rough him up and I get paid. You know, I've got this buddy who's kinda strapped for cash too, if you catch my drift. Fine, you both get paid. Just make sure you finish the job. Huh? Oh, it's you. 
132,000 yen, right? Oh my god. That's the same trick he used on my son. If you know what's good oh, for right. him, that's how much he asked I'd for stay it. the hell away from him. So the son just gave him 132,000 yen? I just had to go back to the dorm. Jeez, man. Oh, welcome back. Thank you. So, um... I saw something on TV about people with apathy syndrome. Apparently everyone was cruel all, all at the same time. Oh, cured. Wow, I read good. It was cured all at the same time. It's a little strange, isn't it? I mean, there's no exact... There's no way everyone can recover at the exact same time. Mm. So how... I don't know. I guess we'll never know. Last Tanabata. At the time, many people wrote wishes for them to recover. But as of today, the number of apathy syndrome victims have been decreasing. Looks like the wishes came true, however belatedly. Beggars can't be choosers, my hmm. friend. Beggars can't be choosers. Thinking about putting some food together. You got some time on your hands? Would you want to cook with me? Uh, maybe another time. Um. Hmm. Everyone seems so exhausted. We don't have the whole group here anyway, so let's skip going to Tartarus tonight. Dude, our missions are always so exhausting. But last night was even worse because we ran into those Strega guys. Yeah, just talking just took it out of me. Like, just right out of me. Man, they look, uh... And they look a... And they look like a pretty annoying bunch. Man, I wish they'd just piss off. Hello there. There are four shadows remaining. But it's our best next time, too. However, the members of Strega also appear to be our enemies. Let us remain vigilant and continue taking the shadows down. Sounds like a plan. Um, actually... Let's see if there's anything new going on. Try the wild duck challenge. Uh, yeah, I think I'll do that. Yep. This is a ridiculous amount of burgers. I wonder if I'll be able to finish everything. No matter how much I eat, the amount of burgers doesn't seem to decrease. Alright, look away from the burgers. Eating while staring off in the distance made me feel a little better. I feel like I'm making progress, but I shouldn't get ahead of myself. Eat without stopping, take breaks in between bites, wash down... Oh, I forgot what I did last time. I think I did take breaks in between. Let's try wash it down with soda. My stomach hurts. I lost pace. Nope, that was not right. So just continue eating, I guess, is the way to go. Hmm. Oh, is this Pharos? He's saying, well done, we'll meet again. Hi, how are you doing? Just can't get a good night's sleep, can we? More. The end won't be brought about by any one person in particular. It's going to happen because there are many who wish for it. Almost as if it was decided from the beginning. But isn't it strange that there are those who would wish to bring about the end? No one wants that. You really think so? What about the ones who just want their suffering to end, so they can be at peace? Well, enough of that for now. There was one more thing I wanted to tell you today. Soon, 
The flowers of poison will bloom. Three in the rival garden, and one in your own. I don't oh. know if this has anything to do with the end, but you should be careful. So three in the rival garden and one on our end. Is that what he, whoop, that's what he said, right? So flowers of poison will bloom. Three in the rival garden. So I'm guessing that's Strega. And one in one in your own. So someone in our group is going to betray us in some way. Or at least hinder us in some way. Thanks for the warning. I'm happy to hear you say that. I'll let you know if I find out anything else. That's what friends are for, right? Pharos gives me a carefree smile. I sense a bond between Pharos and me. Why would you sense a bond from a carefree smile? It means he doesn't give a shit. Well then, good night. Saturday. Hello, this is Elizabeth speaking. I'm calling in regard to a recent change in Tartarus. It seems that a path that had been blocked off is now open. I thought it prudent to inform you. Well then, I wish you a safe journey. Yep, let's check it out next time we go to Tartarus. Yep, yep, yep. It's me. I'm sorry to disturb you, but do you have a moment? Coming. Good morning. There's actually something I need to tell everyone, but I think it would be best if you saw it for yourself. So I'd like for all of us to meet in the command room tonight. I'll see you then. Okay. I like to take walks around the station, and sometimes I see a peculiar looking girl. Now don't freak out, but listen to this. She's got a sword stuck through her head. I know those young girls like the piercings, but the entire head? Eh? You think it was some kind of trick? Well, if it was, it sure fooled me. No, it was someone with a real sword just, you know. It's a fad nowadays, you know. It's, it's just a fashion. My friend knows a lot about that revenge website. Like a little too much, you know? Makes me wonder if he's been using the site to take revenge. He kept bringing it up. So I came out and said, isn't that just a stupid rumor? And you were never seen again, is what you're saying. Munch munch burp. Oh, Makoto-kun. I've been waiting for you. I can hear my stomach wailing in agony. Wonderful, my gourmet friend. First, I have some excellent news to share. Then, afterwards, hmm. Oh, I know just the place. Hey! I did it! I finally met my quota! I found someone else to welcome into our vlog! You have a quota? No! Speak of the devil! Oh, wow. Are you interested in joining too? Finally, paradise is smiling back at me. Yes, yes! Uh, just knock it off. Well, what are you saying? That I should just abandon these people to their fate? I'm trying to save these people. They've suffered in this world just like me. Someone as good looking as you could never understand. You have no idea what people like me have to go through. Fine. If you're gonna try and stop me, then. then you and I are through! Oh? 
I have never seen this before. Don't follow me around anymore. Only true believers are allowed into paradise. The new recruits seem familiar. I'm worried about Suomitsu. I better follow him. I've never seen that before. Huh? W what is this? Is this an emergency? A serious emergency? So the world's coming to an end, huh? I think I remember some other cult saying stuff like that. Except they really weren't about initiation fees. It was more about giving up material wealth, wasn't it? Stealing ideas from real, actual religions. <laughs> That's a textbook cult tactic, you know? You mean... This was all a trick? Oh, yeah. You've been duped, kid. But not by us. You should blame that cult you believe in so much. Now that I know the truth, I almost feel sorry for you. But you had to take things too far. Try not to hit his face. If you leave any marks, you might be able to press charges. <laughs> am I... Am I gonna die? His nose is dripping too. <laughs> but, but if I die here, I'll be reborn. And I can go to paradise. I'm not scared. I'm not scared. What? What are you doing here? After I said such awful things to you, th that we were through. I'm freaking out. I don't want them to hurt me. Okay, I guess the reverse reverse itself. So Mitsu really trusts me with all his heart. I feel like our relationship is stronger. Okay. What the fuck? <laughs> I'm sorry. I don't remember that at all. Gross, dude, you're getting snot everywhere. Screw this, I gotta get to work. <sighs> I've had just about enough of this. Look, just forget about the money. But I don't ever want to see you near my son again. You're so wonderful. You have such a kind soul. Took Suomitsu home and went back to the dorm. Jesus, what a fucking... Oh, what a social link. Have we received a new mission? I don't know, but the alarm's not ringing. Little puppers. Karo-chan! Are your wounds healed up? Huh? Where'd you get this collar? That collar is designed to help control his persona. Basically, it's an evoker for dogs. Wait, does that mean Korumaru was going to fight with us? I honestly wasn't expecting this either, but... The test results show it's quite possible. In fact, it was actually a request from the chairman. We'll be looking after him here in the dorm. Koro-chan, is this what you want? Arf! Arf. Uh, Arf. Says, I was right. I'm returning the favor. Man, you're one loyal dog. Arf. Hey, sounds good to me. I, for one, welcome him with open arms. The more the merrier, right? Who cares if you're a dog? Good to have you, boy. Who's a good puppy? All right, I'll take him for a walk. And it's the perfect time, because it's summer break. 
Look at his little tail yes, wagging around. It is. You're free to enjoy your vacation, but don't forget about your schoolwork. Summer classes start next week, so don't lose focus just because we have a lot of time off. Uh, summer... Wait, what'd you say? Summer classes. Did you not hear about them? We're going to be taking supplemental courses. I've already applied for all of us. I know how difficult it's been to balance both school and our late night excursions. I'm sure you haven't had much time to study, so I apologize for that. The chairman agreed it was a good idea as well. I could have sworn I told Takeba and Yamagishi. Are you serious? First I've heard of it. I, I protest. I got the highest mark in my grade. I don't need supplemental education. Thank you, though. I'm good. Oh, um, sorry. I completely forgot to mention it. No way! Hey, you're the one with the worst grades here. Why are you so surprised? Come on! I want to hear it. <laughs> this sucks. Don't you think? It's whatever. Um, I don't mind, I guess. Uh, well, it's only for a few weeks, so let's do our best. At any rate, we've gained a new ally. Kurobaru, he's a loyal companion who will fight valiantly for his master. As a team leader, I properly, I must properly support him. Oh wow. Uh, is there anyone up here? No. Alright. What? Summer school, huh? Well, it's not that I hate studying that much, but... I just don't think we should have to go to school during summer vacation, you know? I agree. Especially if I don't fucking need it. Could it be? I didn't expect to meet Persona users outside of ourselves, and those we've located and recruited. Not to mention ones filled with malice and hostility. As if we haven't been busy enough keeping the shadows at bay. Hello. Dogs can be very reliable, you know. Why, there are rescue dogs, seeing eye dogs, narcotic detection dogs. Let's put our trust in Koromaru. I comprehend. Koromaru san's persona exhibits a unique characteristics. It seems he has two types of powers that can be activated when using Theurgy. This is one of his biggest advantages. Oh. Who's a good puppy? Koromaru looks content. Maybe I should take him for a walk tomorrow instead. Oh, we can take him for a walk. Cool. Yeah. Want to watch another DVD? It's a match with the heavyweight champ who may consider to be the greatest of all time. I burned the DVD, TV recording on the, onto a DVD a while ago, and I suddenly feel like watching it again. Um. Yeah. Actually, let's yeah. see if there's anything else going on in town first. What's going on here? Ooh, Tanaka. Tanaka, Naka, Naka. I hear it's almost time for the summer festival. Damn it, I don't have anyone to go with. Oh well, I'll find someone. Welcome. You want to make an impression? Excess rising is a must. Let's see what else he's got. Um, why would I buy these? Oh right. Why thank you. Why, thank you. He's got nothing new. I lost the ring in my room, and the other fortune teller couldn't find it. But when I asked Mama, she told me where it was on the first try. I couldn't believe my eyes when I found it. I like a dream. Amazing. I've got a few things I'd like to find, too. Maybe I should ask her. Would you like to know your fortune? I want to know my future. Then let us begin. 
Three blades close in on you, tearing the shadow apart. A brave howl confronts them. Things seem to be staring around you once again. There is more. In the depths of the abyss, another blade watches you closely. Let us hope you find fortune in your destiny. Thank you. I guess. Uh, guess I'll do Tanaka. Southern Cassowary kills... kills who? As if. I'll be at PAW today as well. Come right away. Do not reply to this message. Please contact us through the official inquiry portal. Amazing Commodities Corp. Yeah, I guess so. Oh? Well, if it isn't Yuki. Alright. Yeah. I like your attitude. All right then, let's get right to it. Today, I'll tell you a funny story. These days, even a grade schooler knows how to buy stocks online. How about you? Interested in stock trading? Maybe a little. <laughs> That's the spirit. If you keep all your money in the bank, your modest gains will be offset by outrageous fees. Don't let the fear of bankruptcy dissuade you. It pays to be aggressive in the management of your assets. My company just went public on the stock exchange. Since our sales were skyrocketing, we decided to sell shares. And guess what? The number of shareholders skyrocketed too. Very nice. Now listen. <laughs> this is the funny part. The majority of our shareholders <laughs> are also our customers. They keep buying more of our products, so of course the stock will rise. Isn't that hysterical? <laughs> you should learn to appreciate the irony. Oh, I do. Thinking of offering you a job, so you should come up with some stories of your own. I receive passionate advice from President Tanaka. I understand him a little better now. Have you been keeping your promise? Uh, you didn't tell anyone. No, did you? I haven't. If you go back on your word, I'll find out where you live and ring the doorbell every night. Okay. There's some boundary pushing going on here, all right? You you got to stop with these threats. Th this is serious business. Bring my doorbell every fucking I will I will murder you. I will murder you. It's amazing commodity. I'm going to do it. Isn't he driving you to your wit's end? Cool off with these refreshing good, drinks. Good. First up, we have the isotope soda. And you get ten of them. So cool. So refreshing. Oh my goodness, it's wonderful. But wait! There's more. Not bad, kid. We'll throw in this Mad Bull too. Guess how many? Twenty! All this for just 3,980 yen. These items were a big hit last week, so we're going to be selling them again this week. Yeah, why not? It's actually a pretty good deal. Thanks, kid. Next time, we'll be introducing a spooky season set. Don't miss it. Bye bye. Bye bye. Yori. Then, sure, let's go see what Junpei is saying first. Yo! I'm a Koto, perfect timing. See my message? The one about my great idea? No. I was thinking of carrying it out. Uh, not now. Oh, really? Seriously? Man, I guess we could do it some other time then. If you spend your vacation doing nothing, summer will be over before you know it. Listen, man, we gotta 
You gotta help me with my crazy genius idea. So hurry and haul your asses to the strip mall. Okay. But what's going on here then? Uh. Oh, little girl. Rumor loving girl. Order ice cream at the sweet shop and eat it without stopping, even if you get a break, please. You do that three times in a row, you get a stomachache. I mean, duh. You got me. Alright, since we're here, make use of good time. Or make good use of time, rather. Is there anything here? There is. And... Nothing. Oh, I, I faked you guys out. You thought there'd be something new this time. I know you did. Yo. All right, let's 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 hang out with you, okay? <laughs> Sucks it's on a Sunday, but what you gonna do? Okay, then I'm gonna buy the thing we need. Just wait here for me. That's one magnificent melon, ain't she? It's the highlight of my day. So, I've been thinking of throwing a watermelon splitting party. We haven't really done anything summery since vacation started, you know? Especially Amada. He always looks so bored when I see him in the dorm. And man, that kills me to see. It'd be a real shame if he didn't have a single entry in his summer picture diary. That's so thoughtful of you. Or... Yeah, that's thoughtful of you. <laughs> I can already see the look on his face. He'll be like, Jupe-san, you're super cool and you're super nice. Oh, I mean, don't you know? Oh, what? They say women can't resist a guy with a soft spot for kids. And you know what that means? I'm going to need your help. It's a win-win situation, don't you think? And you know, oh boy. I think my arms are going to fall off. Ah, yes. Today shaping up to be a glorious day. It's such a shame that the third years and the ladies won't be joining us. Um, if we're splitting watermelons, I'm out. What? Just like that? You're not even going to hear me out? You have a watermelon and a bat. What else could it possibly be? That's more for little kids anyway. Plus, it's really hot out. And look, I get you're trying to be nice. You should join us. Yeah, for real. Without you, it would just be me and him, you know? And isn't that just the saddest thing you ever heard? Well, when you put it that way, I guess I don't have a choice. No, sit down. You too, Korum. I know, Koromaru. Don't you worry, boy. We didn't forget about you. All right. What are we waiting for? The youngest gets to draw first blood. Technically, that will be Koromaru. This is what real summer feels like. My blood's pumping something fierce. Look who's acting like a kid now. <laughs> oh, yeah. Where's the blindfold? We can't split watermelons with just a bat. Speaking of, this bat seems kind of worn in. Doesn't it? Oh, wow. You got that. Pat Bat and I go way back. Had it since I was in Little League. I've never mentioned this before. No, it sounds familiar. Oh, yeah? Well, it's not some big secret or anything. I used to play tons of baseball back in the day. But that's old news now. Wait, then should we really be hitting watermelons with this? Hmm? Ah, uh, well, nah, it's cool. Don't think I'll be using it much from here on out. <laughs> What's wrong, bud? Dying to chomp on some melon? Or Mara's trying to tell us something. Are you about to pee on it? Hey, come on, Kormaru. He can't swing at the watermelon with you in the way. Koromaru? 
Hey, why don't we use something other than the bat? Good idea. See? Senpai thinks so too. Then what else are we gonna use? How about a knife? Um, anything, I guess. Just as long as it's interesting. Interesting? Kind of a weird request. Oh! Like if Sonata-san uses bare hands? Someone say my name? <laughs> Whoa, Sonata-san. I can just imagine he like poured it from wherever he was. He was like halfway across town. Just like Sonata-san. <laughs> Someone say my name. It's like the Simpsons. Did I hear a briefcase opening? <laughs> it's hilarious. Well, when I got back, I thought I heard voices coming from the roof. So I came to check it out. Hmm. Watermelon splitting, huh? That's right. We were just talking about what to use to hit it. You're not gonna use that bat? We want to use something else. Yeah. We were just saying you could probably oh do it with God. your bare hands. This is... Okay. That is tempting, considering how huge it is. Are you sure it's okay? This is not the first game where they've had, like, the whole watermelon, like... It's just, like, the icing on the cake for, like, the day. Like, making it all the better. I personally don't get it. I don't know if, like, watermelons are, like, a rare commodity in Japan. But, like, this is... I, I don't know where this is going. I don't know why this is here. And it's going on way too long, in my opinion. It's... Like, why, why are we discussing? Just get a fucking knife and cut it and eat it. Like, I, I don't know why we have to smash the shit out of it to eat it. Again, it might be a Japan culture thing. I, I don't know. Huh? Uh, sure. If that's what you want. Alright. Guess I better make this good then. Hey, try not to go all out or there won't be any left to eat. Yeah! Sonata-san, you're incredible! And half of it got pulverized. What? What the heck? How are we supposed to eat it now? Can't believe that thing was still edible after it exploded like that. Didn't go exactly how I was expecting, but looked like a mod at one. <sighs> Man, I was acting kind of lame back there, huh? You know, before we busted the melon. I'm talking about the whole bat thing. You were just trying to be thoughtful. I didn't want to come off like I was having second thoughts, but I guess I couldn't help it, huh? I was supposed to be this cool mentor, but instead, kid ends up pitying me. You have great qualities. <laughs> Don't worry about me anymore. I'll just get even sadder, you know? I mean, I'm not saying it's your fault, dude. Uh, how the hell do I put it? Uh, this is a me problem. It probably doesn't make sense. I feel like my life, my teenage years, it's just all over the place. Anyway, I think we're done for today, yeah? Appreciate you helping me prep and clean up. Well, let's head back downstairs. I feel like my charm has improved after seeing how considerate Junpei is. I did all this just for one charm? Are you fucking kidding me? I would much rather finish off the Hermit uh, ah, social link. I just came by to check in on Koromaru. Do you think he'll do well? Sure. Yeah, he'll be fine. That's good to hear. Well, given his reputation for loyalty, I wasn't too worried in the first place. If you have any concerns, please feel free to let me know anytime. It's only fair, considering I was the one who requested that Koromaru join the squad. Oh, I'm all for Koromaru joining us. He's totally welcome. I'll even throw in training lessons from the master. Um, I'm pretty sure Koro-chan's already more disciplined than you. Could you even sit still if someone told you to stay? Hey, don't compare me to a dog. I'm totally disciplined. 
I can follow directions. Kinda. Yeah, you really sold us on it. Anyway, so, Mr. Chairman, uh, about those summer classes. Ah, yes, I heard about Kirijo-kun's plan. It sounded like a good idea, so I went along with it. No, why would you agree to that? Oh, was I being nosy? Oh, I'm missing out on my passionate summer romance. She's disappearing before my eyes. Farewell, my beautiful city girl. Awaiting me by the shoreline. The city or the shores. Yeah. Pick one. Even if you didn't have classes, you'd probably just bum around the station all day. You should just accept your fate. Oh, by the way, Mr. Chairman, weren't you about to tell us something before he arrived? Hmm? Ah, that's right. Aside from my unnecessary meddling, I do have another request for all of you. Does everyone have a moment? Sure. I think it's a good time for you all to get a routine health checkup. You know where Tatsumi Memorial Hospital is, right? Oh, that's where Sonata Senpai was treated before. With how much you've all been fighting lately, it'd be best to stay on top of your physical health. It wouldn't be good if your personas were causing any strain on your bodies, right? I expect it shouldn't be too much of a detour to stop by the hospital after your summer classes. I understand. Still, this is rather sudden. Don't worry too much about it. Like they say, a stitch in time saves nine. Or your side. We'll be doing the checkups individually, one day at a time. You can decide amongst yourselves who goes when. Don't forget to deck up for your checkup. <laughs> uh, just kidding. All right, dude, just, just, just stop. Oh, maybe bring your evokers in case you need to take any shots. <laughs> yes. I'm just talking with everyone about Koromaru. He'll be, he'll need to be taken on walks, but we won't be assigning that duty to anyone in particular. It would help if you could take Kuromaru out for a walk at night if it seems he wants to go for one. You see, I don't want to hear that your grades are slipping because you're spending too much time in Tartarus. There's nothing I can do to help with that. So study hard and do your best in summer school. Bro, I'm almost maxed out on my brain power. It must be easier taking Kuromaru on walks with the nights being cooler this time of year. Dogs can't regulate their body heat by sweating, you see. So remember to keep an eye on them. On the next episode of Phoenix Ranger Featherman R. Episode 25, The Shadow's Half Smile. Has a shadow lost its mind after seeing the light? On to the news. By the way. Oh right, this is Koromaru's new home, isn't it? It's going to be a lot of fun with them around. You know, I think the most suspension of disbelief I need to have with this game is that there's like, what, 10 people in this house and not one of them has an allergy to the fucking dog? Yo. Sports to school work the same. No matter how strong you are, those who don't put in the effort, fail. It's the same with school. If you don't study, you won't pass your tests. Mind your own biz. Hey, hey, hey. Hey, hey, hey. Um... Can I help you? Um, can I, like, help you? Like, what do you want? Let's see. Again, not wanting to attend summer school, but I think it's necessary. After we defeat the rest of the Shadows, we'll become ordinary high school students again. And if we fall behind in our studies now, we'll be in big trouble later. <laughs> That's it. Junpei the Wise has yet another brilliant idea. All I have to do is become a dog. Then I won't have to go to summer school either. Yes? Hmm. Korachan is trying to say something. I bet he's complimenting me for being so smart. Are you stupid or something? I bet he's laughing at you saying how stupid you are. Stupid. Mm. Summer school starts tomorrow. Honestly, the more I think about it, the more I'm dreading yeah, it. Yeah, seriously! Damn right. Hey, Kuromaru, wanna switch, switch places with me? 
All right, who wants to go for a little walk? Zoromaru is looking at me with bleeding eyes. Seems to want to go for a walk. Let's take him for a walk. Oh, I should have checked. Nah, whatever. Oh, hey, what's up? Oh, is bro. that your dog? It is. Wow, he looks like a smart one. Unlike his owner. <laughs> I'm just joking. Yeah, yeah. So, how's life, man? Amazing. And I love how the girl in that show has this mature vibe. You know what I mean? No. <laughs> what? Whoa. Looks like this guy's had his fair share of fun. Guess we should start heading home then. See, it's cool. Peace. Cormoro and I return to the dorm. Summer school starts today. It's about time to leave. Good morning. Phew, it's already so hot at this hour. By the way, have you heard anything about the dates for the health checkup? I haven't. Jeez. What, really? I told Junpei to let you know. Yours is on August 14th, you know. so in four days. Anyway, seriously, way too hot out here. Let's hurry and get inside. I need to be in a classroom with air conditioning. Stat. The first day of summer school. Despite the summer heat, I managed to pay attention to the lecture. I became smart, yo. Oh, we don't even get the evening? It's the second day of summer school. Let's get on with today's lesson. I know it's hot, everyone, but let's just try and get through class. Focus, focus. <laughs> Still, who would have thought people would actually attend this course over the summer? You sure are a curious lot. I'm not really sure what to make of that. Well, anyway, let's talk about something interesting today. All you future magicians will want to pay close attention. Today's subject is tarot. That's right, those cards often used in fortune telling. Despite originating in 15th century Europe as normal playing cards, tarot cards evolved into tools of divination. <clears throat> there are a variety of tarot card decks, including the Marseille and the Rider decks. Excuse me. But today, in honor of the great Crowley, we will be using the Thoth deck. So, continue. As an Alistair Crowley? First, let's talk about the composition of the deck. The modern 78, tar 78 card tarot deck is divided into two parts. There are 22 major arcana, face cards, and 56 minor arcana, our number cards. The minor arcana are also sometimes called pip cards. The major arcana feature a variety of illustrations on their faces. Be beginning with the fool and ending with the universe. They tell a story in numerical order that represents an individual's journey through life. Each major arcana represents a stage on that journey. And each stage represents an event uh, an individual must experience to achieve wholeness. Let's do just that. They're all, they're all important, so let's take a look at each of the 22 cards one by one. The first card, numbered zero, is the Fool. It represents beginnings and suggests infinite possibilities. In other words, the beginning of life. The next card, the Magician, represents action and initiative, but also immaturity. The High Priestess represents contemplation and inner knowledge. We're really going to go through this one by one. The Empress represents both motherhood and maternal love, as well as one's vitality. The Emperor is an opposing card. It represents fatherhood, as well as leadership and decision-making skills. Hierophant represents formality and knowledge. It is a symbol for religion. That is to say... The Lovers represents choice. Here, the individual finally begins to develop a conscience. The Chariot represents the individual's victory, but only a momentary one. Justice is, about, is exactly what it sounds like, knowing what is right and what is wrong. The Hermit represents self-reflection. In other words, searching for answers deep within one's heart. Fortune represents fate and the opportunities it brings. Strength represents both passion and self-control. It is depicted as power with reason. 
The hangman reflects the individual's inability to take action. The spiritual death awaits the individual with the 13th card, which is aptly named Death. Death is considered a transitional card. With death, the old ends and the new begins. All right. Now, let us move on to what happens following the transition. Temperance is the balancing of opposites. Opening one's eyes to the world allows for growth. Then, an encounter with the devil is where one faces temptation. At the tower, the individual's values start to collapse. It seems as if there is nothing to believe in. The individual then finds a glimmer of hope in the star, granting one peace and serenity. In turn, this makes one vulnerable to the moon's illusions, which gives way to fear and trepidation. But the individual may be rewarded with a bright future by the sun, which signifies true achievement. Judgment awaits the individual at the journey's end when looking back on the path one has traveled. The final card is the universe, which represents the individual reaching full awareness. And that's the growth of an individual as explained by the tarot cards. Perhaps all this talk about life doesn't hit you, doesn't hit home with you young folks just yet. Hmm? Well then. Well, now you can use all 78 cards to divine the future in detail. But most people uh, only use the 22 Major Arcana. Okay, next let's talk about fortune telling using the Major Arcana. First, you will need to shuffle the cards. If a card is reversed, its meaning will change. Now this is important, so pay attention. Mr. Edagawa continues to drone on and on. Despite the summer heat, I managed to pay attention to his lecture. This is what they teach in school, really? How to read tarot cards? Fuck, man. It's the third day of summer school. Despite the summer heat, manage to pay attention to the lecture. Ah, got smarter. Man, I don't get to do anything in the evening at all. It's the fourth day of summer school. Yep. It's almost time to head to summer school. I need to stop by Tatsumi Memorial Hospital on the way back later today. All right. Day of summer school. I uh, guess we'll get started. Now let's begin. Yod hey vav hey. How are you all at handing? How are you all handing the heat? I could brew some of my special tea if you'd like. Now, let's continue with our special summer course, The Truth Behind Magic. This is what we signed up for. The special summer course is about fucking magic. I'll be talking about Kabbalah. I assume all of you have at least heard of Kabbalah, yes? Yeah, you spoke about it earlier, earlier in the game. It is known as the mystical study of the Hebrew scriptures. But, as I mentioned before, it, has a, it had a great impact on Western sorcery. It has been said that, to learn the secrets of magic, you must first understand Kabbalah. Okay, then. So, who was the person who formed this incredible ideology known as Kabbalah? Well, according to legend, it was Moses. Yes, that Moses. Moses who gave us the Ten Commandments and split the Red Sea. But in reality, it was formulated by a group of rabbis long, long ago. However, because it features a complicated code system, Kabbalah did not become known to the Western world until much later. Now, it is important to note that there are many different ancient methods of deciphering Kabbalah. For example, there is Gematria, the interpretation of text by replacing letters with the numbers they represent. There is Nota Notarikon, where you take a letter from each word to form another sentence or thought. There is also Temura, a method where letters of words are replaced, thereby giving the sentence a new meaning. 
All these different methods make it difficult to fully comprehend Kabbalah. So, continuing on. Now, one of the most important ideas of Kabbalah is the Tree of Life, comprised of the ten Sephirot. Sephirot! Most illustrations depict it as a chart shaped like a tree. The ten nodes represented by the Sephirot and the twenty-two paths connecting them all come together to form a map of God's creation and the spiritual ascent of man. Where do we come from? Where are we going? These answers, answers lie in the Sephirot. When training your magic, it is important to picture the Sephirot every so often. And when you are meditating, you should focus on the Sephirot as well. This is going to be on the test, you know. They say knowledge is another form of magic, so study hard. If you find yourself struggling, well, you may wish to return to the Sephirot. By the way, did you all notice that I said there were 22 paths? Yes, just like the Arcana. I know. <laughs> yes, that's right. The same number as the Major Arcana I spoke of before. Now, continuing on. According to Kabbalah, existence is broken up into four worlds. Oh yes, before I forget, I'll be giving supplementary lessons at the nurse's office as of the second semester. I'm thinking of doing demonstrations with tarot cards. As such. But I won't have time for that during the lecture, so if you're interested, stop by after school. Everyone is welcome. Alright, good to know. Continues to drone on and on. Should go to Tatsumi Memorial Little Hospital for my checkup. Thanks for being so patient. That just about concludes your checkup. Sorry yours ended up taking so much longer than everyone else's. It's all right. Oh, I'm glad to hear you say that. Although we could have done it another time and taken a full day for it. Your persona abilities are rather unusual compared to the others, aren't they? That's why we had to run so many more tests on you. Well, based on how you've performed so far, I don't expect there to be any problems. Persona abilities can be dangerous, depending on how they're used. With that in mind, it can't hurt to err on the side of caution. How are you feeling about it? Do you have any concerns about your power? Um, you could say that. That's understandable. But I don't think there will be any issues with your test results. And based on what I'm hearing from Kirijo-kun's reports, you've been performing just fine. I truly am grateful for everything the team has done, especially you. Things have really changed for the better since you arrived. Our team has grown, and we've even figured out how we can eliminate the dark hour. In a way, you've sort of gotten the clock ticking for us again. It's almost as if we were just waiting for you these past ten years. <laughs> <laughs> I'm afraid I can only support you from behind the scenes. But I'll be counting on you to eliminate the four remaining shadows. Me specifically, not the now whole team? then, it's getting pretty late. Why don't we get you back to the door? Oops, excuse me for a second. Hello? Oh, thanks for your help the other day. Uh-huh. Yes. It's missing from that document? It's urgent? Wait, but, but by today? Looks like you received an urgent call. I should head back to the dorm alone. Yeah, just, just leave the guy. Let him suffer alone. Iwatodai. Iwatodai. This is the final train bound for Tatsumi Port Island. Please board before the scheduled departure time. Station now. So wait. The the test took all afternoon and evening? Are you fucking kidding me? He was there for like what eight hours? Cause it's fucking midnight. It's so late. We were starting to get worried. Um, did you run into any trouble? My checkup took a while. Oh, I see. I hope you 
hope everything's all right. Me too. I'll let you reach us, Empire now. We're in the command room right now. I'll go ahead and navigate you back to the dorm. I'm sure you'll be fine, but considering what happened with Korochan, I'd rather play it safe. Thanks. <sighs> Wait, I can sense a shadow! And it's really close to you! It's over at the Moonlight Bridge! It's too dangerous to go alone. You should stay put until everyone else gets there. Oh no! There's another reading near the shadow! It's a person! Uh... I'll buy some time. What the fuck is that? And what have we here? So much power, so much chaos. I'd not be foolish enough to turn my back on such a predator. And on top of that, we have an unexpected guest tonight. Not a very favorable situation, all things considered. So, given this little predicament, how do you intend to partake? Uh, I'm here to help? The enemy of my enemy is my friend, is it? Sound reasoning. Guess we're fighting together. Oh, he's gonna tell what that I have- I'm a multi-persona user. Not? Well then, shall we begin? To do. Um. Never mind. And there's. I can't tell what this guy's weaknesses are. Um. Guess I'll try lightning first. Hmm. So that's your strategy. This too is fate. Ah! I'm impressed. It's tougher than it looks. You make a good target. Oh no, boy. I'll go with. That was quite but it's time to end this. Can you dodge this? As a reward for your efforts, let me show you my power. Come! Persona! Here is an offering of sons. The fuck is that? The finale was surprisingly unsatisfying, wasn't it? The shadow seems to have dropped something. Looks like a gun. Hmm. Your persona ability is truly fascinating. It's different from the one I saw the last time, isn't it? So, you can choose from multiple personas to fit the situation. You must be burdened with an extremely unusual fate. It seems your friend has arrived. Then I suppose I'll have to be on my way for tonight. Wait a minute, what did what it drop? What is your name? Koto Yuki. I'll see to it that I remember. Enemies though we may be, I'm not one for leaving a debt unsettled. I shall have to repay you another time. What did it drop? 
Are you all right? Did you already defeat the Shadow? Good work, but that was an unnecessary risk you took. I had help. You can fill me in on the way back. In any case, I'm glad you're okay. Explain what happened on our way back to the dorm. Interesting turn of events. Yes. Well, there you are. You had a long night, huh? On that note, let's not go to Tartarus tonight. You mean I can actually control my nights now? Uh, why? I'm sorry. I want to look into some matters with the chairman's help. Specifically about that group, Strega. If I find out anything, I'll let you know. Also, I understand your circumstances last night. I've tried to avoid staying out late from now on. So last day of summer school. It was only a week? Yep. Yay, my stuff arrived. <sighs> At least summer school's over now, but doesn't it feel like we kind of wasted our summer vacation? I'll have to make a bunch of plans to make up for it. I wonder if anything is going on soon. I have a suggestion. I'm currently aware of a summer festival tomorrow and a film festival the following day. Oh. Well, that's right. Wait, I guess, are you thinking about going to the festivals? Yes. Indeed, my data indicates that festivals and other like events offer unique experiences. So, for investigative purposes, I shall infiltrate such a shindig. Yeah. Uh huh. Well, I'll try not to stand out too much. Yeah, wear some shoes. Come to think of it, the crops I planted on the rooftop should be ready to harvest by now. Huh? Sakurijo like Senpai and Sonata Senpai went out again. How do they still have energy after summer school? I'm so tired, I think I'm gonna go to bed early tonight. Um... Kirijo Senpai and Sonata Senpai aren't around, so I don't think we can go to Tartarus tonight. I know we haven't been going very often because of summer school, but we don't have much of a choice in the matter. We do. We, we didn't have to go to summer school. Let's see what's on TV. A report on the festival. A man riding on the portable shrine was knocked off. He was uninjured, but three of the shrine barrier bearers underneath him were hospitalized. The inebriated man said, if you're pissed off, try being the one at the top. Interesting. Hey, little puppers. Uh, no, let someone else do it. We gotta harvest. Gonna do some gardening? I'll come too. It's actually a pretty good workout. I didn't think I'd get into this. It doesn't look like he will get more skills. Quality of Protoss might improve. We tend to rooftop planners together. No. Oh. Um. No, you know what? I'll grab it the next day in case I won't be able to walk uh, yes. Koro. I've learned the meaning of the summer festival. It seems like a very interesting event. I'm looking forward to equipping the special armor known as a Yukata. This will be a new experience for me. Sure, that's yeah, it's Tanaka. That's okay. I'll do Tanaka another night. Orf. Yeah. Let's go together. koromaru san seems to be enjoying himself. He's able to go on cherished walks together with his friends. This must be where the summer festival I have heard about will be held. For what reason is it required to equip oneself with this yukata? I would like to infiltrate the site tomorrow to investigate this matter further. <laughs> Welcome back, Koromaru-san. Hmm? You seem to be holding something. Our incense. He wants you to have this. 
Perhaps it was part of his secret stash. Shall we return to the dorm? Let us come again, Koromaru-san. Interesting. All right, Maya Day. Summer vacation continues. Come to think of it, there's a summer festival going on in Naganaki Shrine today. Got a few messages. Summer festival. There's going to be a festival at Naganaki Shrine tonight. Let's check out the stalls together. I can't wait. I was planning on taking Igus there to show her around, but I'm not certain if I make a good guide. If it's not too much trouble, could you come along as well? Who should I go to the summer festival with? Oh, uh... I guess I'll go with Mitsuru. I'll to the shrine when it's time. I can't even do. Oh man! It looks rather busy. I guess be sure not to stray too far from us. Are my words even registering to you? She can't help it. Should we hold hands? I see. So you wish to restrain me? Be warned that my ability to jettison my hand from my wrist would make holding it a poor method of restraint. Fine, fine. Just make sure to stay close to us. Hmm? This aroma. This is takoyaki. Would you like to try some? Can you try some? Shopkeep. I would like to purchase one. Shopkeep? Um, got it. Coming right up. Well, aren't you a lucky guy with two beautiful ladies? I'll throw in an extra for you. On the house. On the house? Do the takoyaki have some kind of architectural purpose? She's like, yes. Mm. Oh, extremely high temperature juices have spurted out from inside. I'm glad you're enjoying it. Looks as though you've had another valuable experience. You should have some too. Show I guess the true nature of takoyaki. As for me, I'll have to decline. Why? I'm watching my figure. What are those? Those are masks. They're worn over the face as a form of recreation. One can find enjoyment by hiding one's face? Hiding your face isn't the objective exactly. Rather, you get to experience having a different one. Hmm. Putting this into words is proving difficult. So then, by wearing a different face, you are able to become a different version of yourself? Yes, Something like that. that's about right. Your degree of comprehension is actually quite stunning. At this rate, a few more tests and the chairman may give you permission to go out on your own. I look forward to that. Hey there, ladies! Wanna try your hand in a lucky draw? Make some nice memories? What do you say? Odds are looking good, lots of winning tickets left. Hmm. Why don't we give it a try? Box is filled with triangular lottery tickets. Uh, dig down to the bottom. Congratulations, you won! Wow, you must have incredible luck to win on your first try. Here is your prize. Enjoy! Jack Frostall. I mean, alright. I have won a water pistol. Between this and my onboard firearms, which is more effective in combat against the shadows? Here, let's trade. In exchange, I'll give you these marbles I won. They're beautiful. Don't you agree? Well, I think we've seen all the vendors now. It's starting to get late, so let's head back. Not yet. 
The mystery of the shooting game is yet unsolved. I precisely struck the item to unbalance its center of gravity, yet it did not even budge. Perhaps you should ask Iori the trick behind it when we return. Come on, let's go. Decided to go back to the dorm. Today we're sprucing things up with the Summer Only Amazing Commodities Monday Special. It's a colorful, colorful voice coming from the TV. Alright. Even though it's Monday, the programming seems to have been rescheduled for summer it's vacation. Amazing commodity. Okay. Uh, I'm going to do it. Spooky season set. Summer calls for a test of courage. Prepare yourself for the set. Good. First up, we have the curse paper. And you'll get three of them. Do you just feel a chill run down your spine? Ooh. Oh my goodness, it's wonderful. But wait! There's more. Not bad, kid. We'll throw in this vanish ball too. Get somebody! Dos! Uh sure, I don't know what curse paper does. Thanks, kid. We'll be introducing part two of the home gardening set. Ooh. Might be able to get some new seeds. But I haven't saved in a good while. Okay, and I think that'll about do it for today. Uh, we certainly did a lot. We beat the boss of the um, the full moon boss. We did some nice summer schoolage. We got a new member, Koro, Koromaru, the cute little puppers. And uh, I guess we'll have to continue on the summer vacation next time. Uh, although it looks like it's almost over because we are halfway through August already. Um, hope you guys are enjoying everything so far. The story's starting to pick up, which uh, I kind of figured it would. Um, I would say at this point, even though in terms of the calendar year there's about six months left, I would say we're maybe only a third through. Somewhere around there. Even though, yeah, we only have four shadows to go, we're about a third through. Um, there's going to be some crazy shit coming up um, that'll really make you reconsider the tone of the game. Not to spoil anything. But yeah, that's all coming up, I would think, within the next maybe five episodes or so. But yeah, in the meantime, thank you all so much for watching, and I will see you guys in the next one. Take care.